Hey everyone, it's Kim Chica. We are back in Soma. We have one more item to get. We're in a room of our headless friends. I'm kind of scared because I hope the thing is not going to chase me anymore. <laughs> um, but we've got one more item to get. Shh. Quiet. I'm walking so loud. I think we need the chip. And we've gone into the upper sections, so I am assuming the lower sections are now what we need to do. I don't know. I'm in the upper, so okay. I guess. Where do I go? I don't think I've gone through this door. So we'll go through here. That's nice. Wait, that takes away power. I'm first going to explore this. <laughs> Sorry, everything sounds. All right, we've got a couple undelivered reports. I know that my headless friend will not give us any information, so let's listen to this. Johan Ross was found dead on the climber this morning. The ARC team went down a couple of days ago, but I see no reason to suspect them playing a part in his death. The climber can't be operated from the abyss, so there was a scheduled retrieval. The climber returned with only the lifeless body of Alpha member Johan Ross. Mm. No traces of the ARC team. Cameron Eames Lansky, all studying the body inside containment. I'll follow up with whatever they find. Delenda S. So this is all suspicious. I'm wondering what went wrong with the Ark. The WoW has been getting more aggressive, pushing all systems to their limits. Ironically, the dead Dr. Johan Ross would be the perfect person to ask why the WoW is making such a big buzz about his passing. After all, the WoW isn't supposed to want anything. And definitely not to mourn people. Hmm. Again. The system overload affects the staff considerably. Headaches, loss of sleep, unwarranted stress. And it seems to be getting worse. I could use some advice if you can get through. Don't have to So what's weird is that I, I got the feeling, I've been getting the feeling the last few episodes that... That's dripping, that's not footsteps. That the WoW, obviously it knows more than it's letting on. It's more conscious than it was letting on. But I'm wondering what Catherine has to do. Because Catherine, again, isn't actually Catherine. It's like Catherine uploaded. But what if the WoW was like using her to use me? Or what if she is developed her own weird consciousness and is trying to use me against the WoW that's actually maybe not so bad? I don't know. Things are out of hand. The staff looks like they're about to explode. Every other person walks around with nosebleeds and the rest keep wiping stains of blood from their eyes to keep Ew. them from overflowing. That's to do with the WoW trying to free Ross somehow for sure. At this point, I wouldn't be surprised if the body just got up and left. Rally Herber, our dispatcher, has been snooping around asking questions she shouldn't. She says she's going down into the abyss to find Alpha. I can't bring myself to stop her. Ah! What? Ooh. Okay, recording documents. All right, on September 13th, Vic ordered the staff at Tau to evacuate and move to the plateau. Together with Engineer Allen, Waldeck, I descended into the abyss to assist, assist the evacuation. Following protocol, we waited at the climber platform for 140 minutes and made several attempts to contact Tau. I decided to move towards the site, thinking I might intercept them. That's when I noticed the guiding lights flickering, and soon the whole path shut down. Omega Sector swallowed by darkness. I pushed on with my floodlight until I heard screaming over the short range radio. It carried on, breaking in and out of range. As I hurried closer to investigate, I came upon the lacerated body of field worker Epin Espinosa. Something big had cut her in two. I considered the importance of saving Tao and more specifically Ross as I heard Espinosa's colleagues getting massacred over the radio. This is brutal. Seeing no way to possibly improve the situation, I hurried back, left the people at Tao to their fate. With some luck, Ross made it back to town and is able to continue his work at Alpha. To avoid further disturbances, I have decided to report the evacuation as a complete failure, hoping it will stop Theta from attempting another one. 
Claudia Eames, the manager of Omicron, had already ordered the climber to stay at the plateau for now. My report on the savage wildlife scared everyone to even stop Waldeck and Darby from maintaining the Lumar probes. It's a good thing Galaski is off-site because I have a feeling he would not have approved. Their restrictions came out slightly more severe as I had anticipated, but I'll take it as long as Ross is left alone to work with the WoW. Okay, so this is prior to Ross dying. Okay. Images? Oh gosh, I don't know if... Hey! I recognize this! Ah, so I guess this is the lady that was just talking. Alright. Well, my headless friend. Nope, nothing there for me? Okay. Let's use this to heal, because I'm sure a monster is still wandering in our midst. I'm sure the power will go out too. Uh. Shit! Frickin'... Mm -hmm. I get downstairs. Uh, I guess I use the stairs. Okay. Okay. Oh, I'm getting so scared again. This is the worst. Okay, okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. So we are in the midsection. <gasps> Fucking fr Shh. <sighs> Can I unlock it from here? No. Freaking A, where is it? Okay, this is the dive room. This is where I'm going to go back to, so I'm not going to worry about that now. Laboratory. South Hall. Is that where I came from? I don't know. That's where I came from. So I suppose the laboratory. No, I didn't have stairs. Where do I go? Ah, here. Oh, gosh. This is bad. Ugh. Robot repair bit. Oh my gosh. <sighs> oh. Nothing. I'm sure there's nothing. Yeah. Okay. Goodbye. Let's unlock this stupid lower section. <laughs> so scared. <laughs> South Hall. <sighs> All right, cortex chip diagnostics. So I need my cortex chip first, I'm sure. What are you? You're alive! <gasps> or maybe, or maybe that's the robot that's affecting me. What is this? N Tau find Alpha, take the gel to Alpha. Ugh. Alpha needs medicine! Into the abyss, take it to Alpha in the abyss. <gasps> Frickin' A! Frickin' no! Okay, I think it's you that's affecting me. Are you affecting me? Okay. 
Okay, okay, I'm gonna... Getting away from that thing. Let's try this. Let's try this. Okay. Oh, so is that the Cortex chip? Okay. Um... What do I need to do? Eject Cortex chip. Mmm... Does this shoot a laser? Oh! Comms, great! Like that? Oh, that's not what we want to do. I don't know what we want to do. Oh, that doesn't sound good. It sounds like he has a... Oh! Oh! Motor! Great! That's perfect! Okay. Comms. Optics. Alright, so I got distracted trying to solve the puzzle. Fixed it. Cortex assembly removed, no signal to host. Now here's the thing. I'm gonna remove it. And I bet you that robo baddie is gonna come get me. Probably. Alright, Cortex ship. Oh gosh, bad music. Bad music. Just gonna walk on up. Oh god, it's saving. The music is ominous. dive place. Medical. Oh! South Hall. Oh, I'm forgetting where it was. Clean room. I need to go upstairs. I need to go upstairs. Okay. Upstairs. Upstairs. North Hall. Dive room. Okay. Dive storage. Dive room. Sneak, sneaky, sneak, sneak. Shh, <gasps> pause, run. Just run. I'm just gonna run. God, God damn it. Lock the door, Lock it up. What's happening? I could just go. Oh my God. Oh, the game's lagging. Oh my God, Lock what's the happening? Door. Lock the door. What's going on? Oh my God. Piss off another one of WoW's monsters. We have everything we need, right? Yeah. Let's get to work. Oh my gosh, that was horrifying. What do I do, Catherine? I hope you're actually my friend. Really badly, I hope you're my friend. Okay, whew. 
All right, um, power suit, great. No, that's not what we do. Activation. Uh, pod D? Oh. Okay, do I need to actually like, go to the suit itself? Okay. There we go, cortex chip. This is crazy. Don't worry, it'll work. Alright, power cell. And structure sure all together with the structure gel connecting all the parts. Ew. Yes, Nancy. Yes. Alright, try activating the seat from the terminal again. Ew, 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 ew. Hopefully it doesn't come alive and kill me, Catherine. Alright. Where do I activate it? Ah, activation, duh. Oh, I'm so shaky from that stupid wow this. monster. It will be fine. Then why don't we put you in the suit? I was gonna suggest that if you refused. What's you why is it flashing? Me. I need to do this, Simon. This is important. I need to launch the Ark. You'd really do it, change body. Yes, if you wanna stay here, I'm not gonna stand in your way. I don't want to tell you what to do. What would be like before? Close my eyes and then... And then open them again. All right, let's do it. Thank you, Simon. <sighs> Go sit in the pilot seat in the next room. You might need to boot it up. Okay. Pilot seat. Oh, there we go. Remote control. This looks familiar. All right, I guess I need to plug this sucker in. Whoops. <laughs> oh, maybe not. Okay. We need to loop back the activity manifested by your current cortex chip, run it through the amplifier, feed it into the new chip, and then make sure it's synced. There's map, 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 map. <laughs> way there. Yeah. You don't really need to understand it. Just make them line up. Make them line up. Okay. I don't know. Okay, so the amplitude looks good. slow that down. Maybe reduce that frequency. Uh, 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 so close, so close. I mean, it's almost there. The frequency should be one. That's pretty dang close. Let's try lock. Nope, signal mismatch. Just kidding. Ah, there we go. Let's lock That's it in. Everything. You can climb into the pilot seat now. Already? I have everything under control. So please have a seat. I'm trusting you, Catherine. Because the WoW keeps killing me or trying to kill me, so. But with the most expensive camera in the world. You know, Indians thought photos would steal their souls. In this case, they'd be right. Uh -huh. uh. Oh, goodbye, world. Copy completed. Whoa. That's wrong. Can't you run a diagnosis or something? <gasps> Wait. What was Oh that? my gosh. That was no, me. Just... Why was it still talking? It's the same like before. Catherine, why was he still talking? That's how it works, you know that. What do you mean? You know it's not magic. You were copied. The sleeping Simon in the seat was copied, and now you are here, just like Simon lived on in Toronto. God what? Damn, two Simons? There can't be two Simons. What did you think would happen? That That's you were going to take my mind and put it into another body, like a brain transplant. I'm sorry, it wouldn't work that way. You realize how messed up this is? Please, I didn't mean to upset you. How did you expect me to react to this shit? Please stop. You're oh. fucking disgusting. Wait, what do I, wait. What's going to happen to him? He'll What's sleep for a while, a few days. And then what, wake up in this fucking nightmare again? All alone? So cruel. Well, what do you want me to do with him? Make friends? Let him know that we have to leave him behind when we go into the abyss? What if... Oh what gosh. if he didn't need to wake up? You do that? I don't know. Maybe. 
There, I set it up for you. Hit the switch if you want to drain his battery. He'll die within a minute. Oh. I'd rather not stay plugged in any longer. Oh my gosh, I can't. I don't know what to do. I guess let me grab Catherine really fast. I mean, okay, here's the crazy thing. So, if we unplug him, he will cease to exist, but I will continue to exist. God, I look like a character from Star Wars. But, that means I... It's like a weird, like, I'm killing myself. But if I leave him alone, he's going to wake up, and he's going to be trapped here with the wow, and that would suck. Like, that would, that would be the worst. That's, like, worse than dying, is solitude like that. But he's just sleeping. I can't, ugh. Oh, my gosh. Okay. I can't leave him here alone in this solitude. Oh my gosh, I feel so bad. Like, what it, I just, what would I want me to do? I wouldn't want to be left alone. I wouldn't. And it, like, he wouldn't have Catherine to explain, like, that everything went okay, that we got to the Ark, but then it doesn't matter because he didn't get to the Ark. Oh, I'm going to drain the battery. Sorry, I'm so sorry. Oh. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Simon. Oh my gosh, his light's fading. Mm. Uh. Goodbye, little Simon. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Oh, that sucked. But, does this mean we get to de begin our descent? I don't know if I made the right decision, guys. I don't know. <sighs> that was brutal. Access granted. Are you going to open up? Maka. Here we go. Actually, and this is this is the beginning, I think, of our descent, so... <gasps> oh my gosh. This is probably a good place to stop. Oh man, that was... I'm really sad, guys. <laughs> Just... Hmm. Um, I don't... Ugh. Yeah, that was hard. It's harder than I thought. Um, thanks for watching this episode of Soma. I guess we're gonna go down to the Ark now. I assume the WoW will make it hard for us. There's gotta be some sort of like final boss battle climax thing happening, so I think we're getting close. And uh, let me know what you think in the comments below. I'm really excited to see how this game ends. I really don't know where it's going, which is kind of great. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. <laughs> Bye!